Russia now. Its largest international economic forum is currently being held in St. Petersburg. The event is being attended by top Russian officials and international leaders. Russia's v President Vladimir Putin is using the event to boost economic ties with other countries such as India. But some countries have decided to steer clear of the event because of Russia's annexation of Crimea. Now, American companies have historically avoided the event for years after the former US President Barack Obama discouraged them from participating. But Donald Trump has urged companies to attend. India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi is the highest profile guest at the event. He's looking to boost trade and relations and attract more Russian investment to India. The European oil giants Total, Royal Dutch Shell and BP are all attending the event and Darren Woods, the CEO of ExxonMobil, is expected to meet with Putin. Well, Yaroslav Lisovolik joins us now from St. Petersburg. He is the chief economist of the Eurasian Development Bank. Uh, thank you so much for joining us uh, on Money Talks this evening. Uh, let me ask you first of all about uh, the American attitude towards the Russians now. A bit of a difference under Trump compared to Obama. Uh, well, yeah, that seems to be the case this time around. We've seen um, a more, uh, should I say, stringent, rigid approach uh, a couple of years back. Um, this time around, it seems that the foreign presence in the forum is uh, more significant and uh, uh, there uh, have not been uh, any uh, signals um, uh, with regard to uh, foreign companies not to attend this forum. So uh, in, in terms of the possibilities and the atmosphere of foreign participation in this forum, it does seem to be significantly better than uh, a couple of years ago. Yaroslav, let me ask you about India. They seem to be the guest of honor this year. We've got a quote here from Narendra Modi, the Prime Minister, says he had a wonderful meeting with Putin during which they discussed the country's relations. Uh, tell us, uh, what, what are relations like between these, these two economies and these two uh, governments? Well, uh, traditionally, they have been always good. And uh, during the Soviet period, uh, Soviet relations with India were uh, on, on a good level. And uh, really fundamentally, whether this is Soviet period or, or post-Soviet period, uh, there were never really any fundamental contradictions politically with, uh, with India. And the anomaly really here is that despite this uh, political foundation, which seems to be very favorable uh, in terms of the economic ties, in terms of the scale of the trade turnover, um, we're talking about very low numbers in terms of the figures in the past several years. We're talking about six to eight billion dollars in terms of uh, mutual trade turnover. And the authorities want to increase that by four to five uh, times in, uh, in, the coming, uh, in the coming years. So there is a significant, tremendous, I would say, potential for bilateral trade, for bilateral investment to right. be... Uh, to be increased, uh, but at this stage, uh, it does seem that uh, th these opportunities are not uh, used effectively. I just want to ask you about the forum itself. What is the, the most that the organizers could hope for from the forum? What are they looking for? Well, I think uh, really, well, basically, this is about Russia being on uh, the radar screens of the investors. This is about really um, bringing more information about uh, business opportunities and investment opportunities in Russia. Uh, so really, this is, um, I think, a forum that is uh, the most important forum in Russia um, where foreign participation is, uh, is significant. And to a significant degree, there is this component of, um, you know, um, a lot of meetings with foreign investors, a lot of participation of foreign experts, foreign officials, uh, foreign business people uh, that is meant really to integrate Russia more into, um, into uh, the investor um, uh, universe, uh, into, uh, into the world economy, if you will. 
And also, this is uh, an opportunity to explore the possibilities in Russia's regions. Russia is the largest uh, country in the world. There are a lot of opportunities outside of Moscow and St. Petersburg. And obviously, there is a lot of uh, a significant uh, component in this forum uh, in terms of uh, regional participation and regions trying to showcase their investment possibilities. Yaroslav Lisovolik, thank you so much.